Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Then me, Alexandra, then me, Arely, Brenda, Isabel, Olga, and Julia Elizabeth. Thank you for your punctuality. Welcome to the class. How are you today? I tired. ¿Cómo se dice tired? Cansada. Yes, you're right. Tired. I'm okay. tired. <laughs> I'm tired. And tell me, Alexandra, how are you? Good, teacher. You are good. Okay, that's great. Olga, how are you tonight? Great. How are you tonight, Olga? Are you okay? Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, Olga. How are you? Um, what is the question? ¿Cómo está el día de hoy? How are you? Um, very well, very well, thank you. Okay, that's great. Thank you for your answer. So, welcome to this class, right? So, finally, the day has come. And today is our last virtual session. Hoy es nuestra última sesión virtual. So, bienvenidos. No. Yeah. <laughs> um, ¿Cómo dices de decir triste? I, I am. I'm sad. Ah, eso. <laughs> I'm sad. Estoy triste. Este, no, el, el, el otro módulo no, no va a estar usted con nosotros. Creería que no, ¿verdad? Pero nada es seguro. ¿verdad? Como igual nos rotan a nosotros con los diferentes niveles, podría ser, podría suceder en algún momento. Christopher, tell me. Good evening, Good Christopher. Tiene eh, una pregunta. ¿Hasta cuándo tenemos para llenar y enviar la, 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 la solicitud para el otro módulo? Creo que era hasta mañana porque salen de vacaciones, salimos de vacaciones el sábado al mediodía, creo que salen de vacaciones todos los administrativos y regresan hasta el 8. De ahí ah, va a poder hasta el 8. Y sobre el diploma no lleva sello, ¿verdad? Eh, así sería como está. Así sería como está en la plataforma. Sí. Ah, ok. Mire, este también... Eh, ¿Verdad que no se puede pasar a, a Word el, el, el diploma, verdad? El detalle es para, para poder anotarlo en el currículo y escanearlo. Y en PDF lo puede descargar, creo. Ah, es que yo lo intenté. Sí, yo, yo lo descargué en PDF, pero me, 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 me descarga de, en PDF. Ajá, y, y así es muy lo difícil. Que, lo que puede hacer es tomarle una captura de pantalla. Tomarle una captura de pantalla y luego recortarla en Word. Ah, ah, vaya. Ah, pues. Bueno, no he pensado en eso, fíjese. Vaya, está bien, teacher. Eso Muchas gracias. Podría ser una salida. Muy bien. Ok, so, espero que todos hayan completado los ejercicios y las evaluaciones dentro de la plataforma. Eh, sus compañeros ya se agarraron vacación. Bueno, espero que se conecten, ¿verdad? En, lo, en el transcurso de la clase. So, let's start. Tonight we are going to have a review of the final exam. ¿Cómo estaba el examen final? Was it easy? Was it difficult? How was it? Difficult, teacher. Oh, tell me, said it was difficult. ¿Y los demás cómo sintieron ese examen? Difficult, teacher. It was difficult. Okay, so we are going to have a review of this test tonight. So let's start with this. Let's go. So this is the This is the topic for tonight, final exam review. We are going to have a review of the final exam. And you say it was difficult. 
So let's start with this. Review the topic studied in this course. That is the objective for tonight. We're going to have a review of some of the topics that we have been studying during this uh, virtual session and also in the platform. So let's start with this listening part. It is the listening in the final exam. So we are going to listen and then we are going to practice. Perfecto, seré tu intérprete. Okay. So take a look at these conversations. It says your name is interesting, Justin. Are you French? Say, no, I'm not. Are you Italian? No, I'm Canadian. You are from Canada? Yes, my family is from Montreal originally. So can you tell me what is the word that is missing? What is la palabra que hace falta? Let's listen again, pay attention. In are you French? No sería are you from teacher? Okay, no. eh, pueden escuchar la conversación. No. 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 Originally. And what about now? One. Your name is interesting, Justine. Are you French? French? No, I'm not. Yes. Italian? Yes. No, I'm Canadian. You're from Canada? Yes. My family is from Montreal originally. Okay. ¿Cuál es la palabra que se falta? Puede ponerlo otra vez, teacher. <laughs> okay, no problem. Let's listen again. One. Your name is interesting, Justine. Are you French? No, I'm not. Are you Italian? No, I'm Canadian. You're from Canada? Yes. My family is from Montreal originally. What is the word? They said, yes, my family is from Montreal originally. Ah, okay, yes, you're right. So we need to add here, my family is from, from Montreal originally. Thank you so much, you're very good. Okay, so your name is interesting, Justin. Are you French? That is a yes, no question. The answer is no, I'm not. Are you Italian? No, I'm Canadian. Are you from Canada? Yes, my family is from Montreal originally. So let's see, where are you from? Con su información, can you answer this question? Are you Salvadorian? What's your answer? Are you Salvadorian? Sería yes, porque está preguntando si somos salvadoreños, teacher. Yes, so are you salvadorian? Yes, What? I yes. am. Okay, I the answer am. with the verb to be yes, I am. Are you from the United States? No, I'm not. No, okay. I'm not. No, I'm not. So, are you American? No. Yes. I'm not. Um. Ah, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bueno. Ese Creí que se había salido. <laughs> um, ese gentilicio se ocupa para las personas que son de los Estados Unidos. American. Then we are Salvadorian. They are American. We are Salvadorian. Aunque vivimos en América. Pero ellos ocupan ese gentilicio. American. So let's see. I need to volunteer to practice in this small conversation. Who wants to try this conversation? Just to volunteers. Let's practice. Thank you, Delmi Arely. 
and I need another volunteer, Arely and let's see who wants to participate. Thank you so much, Alexandra. So Arely and Alexandra. Arely, you are A, Alexandra, you are B. Go ahead, please. Let's practice this conversation. Okay, teacher. Your name is, pero tengo que decir mi nombre o el de la Alexandra. Uh, you can use your name, no problem. Ah, okay. Your name is in, ¿cómo se dice ahí, teacher? Interesting. Interesting. In, your name is interesting. Alexandra, are you French? No, I'm not. Are you Italian? No, I am Canada. You are from Canada? Yes, my family is from Montreal original. Okay, thank you so much. That was excellent. Then where is she from in this conversation? Where is the girl from? Where is she from? Where is just... Where is Justin from? Where is Justin from? Canada. Okay, excellent. So we say she's from Canada. She's from Canada. Let's go with the next conversation. This was the first conversation. One. Then look at the second one. It's a short one. Two. Where's Mike? Uh, Mike? I don't know him. He's my friend from school. He's a little quiet. Oh, is he serious? Actually, no, he's not. He's very funny. Do you have any question? New vocabulary in this small conversation? Where is Mike? The first one is a question. Where is Mike? What is the meaning of that question? What is the meaning of the first question? Where is Mike? ¿Dónde está Mike? Thank you so much. So he's asking for a place. ¿Dónde, verdad? ¿Dónde está Mike? And the boy says, oh, Mike? I don't know him. And the girl says, he's my friend for school. He's a little quiet. Oh, is he serious? Actually, no, he's not. He's very funny. New vocabulary in this conversation. New vocabulary, no new vocabulary. Let's see, he is a little quiet. What is the meaning of that sentence? He is a little quiet. It, it means Un poco tranquilo. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. Uh, él es un poco tranquilo. Oh, is he serious? Is él enojado? Actually, no, he's not. He's very funny. So, actually means en realidad. Actually, no. En realidad, no. He's not. He's very funny. Then, um, adjective. In this conversation, they are using adjective to describe a person. So, he is a little quiet. Is he serious? He is very funny. So, are you quiet? Es usted tranquilo, una persona tranquila. Are you quiet? Then you say, no, yes. Please. Yes, I am. You say, yes, no, I'm I am. Not. You say, no, I'm not. No, I know. Are you serious? Are you serious? Yes, I am. Okay. Are you funny? Y si se dice más o menos, teacher, o un poco, o es, o little. es sí o es no. Little. Ah. Say, I'm a little serious. Soy un poco serio. Funny. I'm a little funny. Soy un poco divertido. So, funny, are you funny? ¿Son ustedes divertidos? El alma de la fiesta. 
are you funny? Then you say, yes, I am. No, I'm not. Little yes, funny. I am, teacher. Ah, okay. That's great. So let's listen again. Pay attention to the pronunciation. Do you remember a WH word intonation? Is it raising or falling? Where's Mike? En esa pregunta, la entonación es raising or falling? Falling. Falling, teacher. Falling, right? Because it's a WH word question. And what about is he serious? The intonation is raising. Raising. Excellent. So let's listen. Pay attention to that. And then we're going to practice in this conversation. Two. Where's Mike? Uh, Mike? I don't know him. He's my friend from school. He's a little quiet. Oh, is he serious? Actually, no, he's not. He's very funny. Okay, I need two volunteers to practice in this conversation. Let's practice. Tonight is our last class, so practice a lot, please. Teacher, aleje la pantalla porque está muy cerca. Uh, what do you mean? Como muy cerca? Pues está, ay, ¿cómo le digo? Con Zoom. No. No sé, si yo la veo así grande. Ok, let's see. Lo que puedo hacer es hacer un poco más pequeña esta letra. Así. Uh -huh. Ok, now can you see it better? Ok, let's see. ¿Pueden ver mejor ahora? Yes. Yes, okay, thank you. So, to volunteer to practice. Julia, do you have a question or do you want to practice? I want to practice. Okay, thank you. Uh, any other volunteer? I have Julia. And who wants to help me in this conversation? Let's practice. It's our last class. Thank you, Olga. Thank you so much. So, Julia, you are A. Olga, you are B in this conversation. You can start, please. Okay. Yes. Where is Mike? Mike? I don't, uh, I don't know him. He's my friend for school. He's a little quiet. Oh, is he serious? Actually, no. He's not, he's very fun. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. So adjective, don't forget that. We use the verb to be to describe people using adjective to describe people personality. Utilizamos el verbo to be para describir la personalidad de... Para describir la personalidad de alguien. ¿verdad? So you say he is funny. He is angry. No, you can say she is funny. She is kind. Ella es amable. She is polite. Ella es educada. Then we use the verb be to describe people's personality. Don't forget about that. Okay, don't forget about that. So let's go with the next conversation. In the next conversation Two. is this one. Let's listen. Three. Wow, it's really warm today. Yes, it sure is. And it's sunny too. No, it's not. Look, it's raining. Oh, oh well. Okay, what are they talking about in this small conversation? What is these people talking about? Acerca de qué están hablando en esta conversación? Del clima. Okay, you're right, thank you. About the weather. They are talking about the weather. 
So what's the weather like? What's the weather like according to the man? De acuerdo al hombre. In the conversation, what's the weather like? It's raining. Sun, sunny. Ok, de acuerdo al caballero, ¿verdad? En esa conversación, the weather is warm and sunny. Warm and sunny. Do you remember the meaning of this word? Warm. Cálido. Ok, yes. and sunny. Cálido. Sunny. Soleado. Soleado, teacher. Ok, soleado, ¿tiene que sonar? And, and the woman says, no, it's not. Look, it's raining. No, no está soleado, le dice ella. Observa, it's raining. ¿Cómo está el clima en realidad? What's the meaning Lluvioso. of raining? Lluvioso. Está lloviendo. It's raining. Está lloviendo. It's, oh, oh, well. Ah, oh, bueno. So, what's the weather like today in the place you live? What's the weather like today there? ¿Cómo está el clima hoy donde usted vive? It's cool. It's cool. That's great. It's cool. Está fresco. Any other answer? What's the weather like in the place you live? In my case, it's warm. Okay, thank you, Ana. It's warm. Yes, because I live in San Miguel. I live in San Miguel. San Miguel. Wow. Yeah. Okay. En, entonces, ¿es verdad lo que dicen? Que es muy caliente en ese lugar. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Wow, okay. Yeah. Bueno, si van a visitar a Ana, recuerden llevar su ventilador en la mochila. You are going to need it. Yeah, you have to. Yeah, you need it. Ah, okay. Thank you, Anna, for your answer. Uh, any other answer? What's the weather? What's the weather like there? You say it, and then you say the weather. It's hot, it's cold, it's windy, it's rainy. So don't forget about that vocabulary, please. No se les olvide ese vocabulario, ¿de acuerdo? So what's the weather like? That is the question. So I need to volunteer to practice in this conversation. Who wants to try? Who wants to participate? Who wants to help me reading this conversation? Thank you, Delmi, Arely, and... I need another volunteer tonight. Who wants? Who wants to try? If no, I'm going to pick someone. Okay. So, Dina. Thank you, Dina. Areli and Dina. So, Areli, you are A. Dina, you are B. Help me, please, within this conversation. Wow. It's really warm today. Yes, it sure is. And it's sunny too. No, it's not. Look, it's raining. Oh, oh well. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Excellent job, Arely and Dina. So talking about the weather in this conversation. Three. And in the last one, so let's listen to this. This is a little bit longer than the last one. Four. Hey, Sue. How are you? Great, Phil. How about you? I'm okay. Hey, you look great. That's a nice suit. Thanks. It's new. Um, where's Ms. Collins? Uh, she's right over there. She's wearing a blue dress. Oh, I see her. Thanks. Okay, what are they talking about in this conversation? So the question, how are you? What's the meaning of that question? How are you? ¿Cómo estás? Okay, and what is a good answer for this question? If I say, how are you? How are you tonight? And 
what I'm is it great. again? Ah, okay, you say, I'm great. That is a nice answer, thank you. Any other answer, any other option to answer this question? How are you? Did I'm I okay. I'm okay. Okay, I'm okay. That is another option, I'm okay. Pretty good. Pretty good, thank you. Any other, do you remember? Not that. Okay, not great. that. Everything great. is good. Great, everything is good. Excellent. More or less. Okay, we need to say so, so, más o menos. And look at the question, how about you? How about you? Eso es como para regresar la pregunta. For example, tell me, how are you? And then Delmi says, I'm okay. And you say, how about you? ¿Y qué hay de ti? How about you? So look at this. Um, hey, Sue, how are you? Great. Phil, how about you? ¿Qué hay de ti? I'm okay. Entonces es como para regresar la pregunta. ¿Y tú? ¿Cómo estás? ¿Qué hay de ti? So we can use this, this question. How are you and how about you? And you look great. That's a nice suit. Te ves muy bien. That's a nice suit. ¿Qué anda usando? Su? Un traje. Un traje, yeah. muy bien. Excellent. Un traje formal. Thanks, it's traje. new. Thanks, it's new. Gracias. Es Lo compré nuevo. en el shopping, pero se mira nuevo. It's new. <risa> so, um, where is Miss Collins? ¿Dónde está la señora Collins? She's right over there. Ella está ahí. She's wearing a blue dress. What is Miss Collins wearing? What is Miss Collins wearing? She's right over there. She's wearing a blue dress. Right over there. She's wearing okay. a blue dress. Okay. The question is, where is Miss Collins? So the answer is, she's right over there. And what is she wearing? She's wearing a blue dress. Do you remember that question? What are you wearing tonight? What are you wearing tonight? Um, wedding is black dress. Okay, I'm wearing a black dress. That's great, great sentence. Thank you, I'm wearing a black dress. Any other answer? What are you wearing tonight? What are you wearing tonight? Then you say, I'm wearing shorts, I'm wearing a t-shirt, I'm wearing sandals, I'm wearing jeans, I'm wearing a pajama, I'm wearing what? Sneakers, a blouse. So that is the answer for that question. Just to finish this part, I need to volunteer to practice in this small conversation, but let's listen again. Let's listen again, and then we're going to practice. Four. Hey, Sue. How are you? Great, Phil. How about you? I'm okay. Hey, you look great. That's a nice suit. Thanks. It's new. Um, where's Ms. Collins? Uh, she's right... Uh, I'm sorry. Right over there. She's wearing a blue dress. Oh, I see her. Thanks. Okay, two volunteers to practice. I have Olga and Delmi. Thank you so much, Olga. And Delmi Arely. So, yes. Olga, you, yes. are, yes. you are A and Delmi, you are B. You can start practicing now. Okay. Hey, Sue, how are you? Great. Bill, how about you? Am I okay? Hey, you look great. 
That's a nice sweet. Thanks. It's new. Where is Mr. Collins? <laughs> Oh, where is Mr. Mrs. Cole? No, es, eso me toca a mí. Que no es la pregunta la que voy a hacer. Yes. La, la B, así, ah, sí, excuse me. Yes, ah, me toca a usted. Thanks, it's no. Who where is Miss Collins? She is right over there. She is wearing a blue dress. Oh. I see her. Thanks. Excellent job. Thank you so much, Olga and Adli. Just this word. Can you help me with this? How do you pronounce this? Let's see this part. How do you pronounce this? I'm okay. Thank you. So you say, I'm okay. I'm okay. In this word, how do you pronounce this? Great. Right. Okay, so you say you look great. You and look that's, great. A, that's a nice suit. That's a nice suit. suit. That's a nice suit. A nice no. That's a nice suit. suit. Okay, excellent. Much better now. That's a nice suit. Okay, that's excellent. A nice suit. Thank you so much, Olga and Natalie. You did a great job in this part. So let's continue with the next. Four. Let's see. In this exercise, we are going to answer this question. I'm going to pick some of you, and you have to answer this. So let's start with Delmi Alexandra. How are you? I am great. Thank you so much. Ana Guadalupe, how are you? I'm excellent. Thank you so much. Brenda, how are you? I'm okay. Julia, how are you? I'm fine, teacher, but a little sad because it's for last class. Okay, I understand you. I'm sad too. Thank you so much. And Alison, how are you? Okay. Alison, how are you? Hi, I'm hello. fine. Um, hello, me escuchas? Hello. Yes, Alison. Um, okay, I'm fine. Um, a little bit tired because I um I had. ¿Cómo se dice? Acabo de terminar de trabajar. I have just oh, finished working. I just finished working and I I arrived at home. Okay, and I arrived at home. Okay, thank you for your answer. Thank you so much. So let's see the next. Let's go with the next question here. This is an easy one. What's your name? Do you remember this question? My name is Brenda. Yes, thank you. Arely. My name is <laughs> tell me, tell me, what's your name? This is an easy one. What's your name? So the answer is my name is Olga. Do you have a question or do you want to answer the question? What's your name? My name is Olga. Oh, thank you so much. Let's go with the next. Number three, where are you from? Claudia Garcia, where are you from? Hello, Claudia, where are you from? I am from Chacate, Coluca. Thank you so much. Delmi Arely, where are you from? Uh, I'm from El Salvador. I'm uh, living in Soyapango. Oh, that's a great answer. Thank you so much. Jorge Lopez, where are you from? Good night, teacher. I am I from... Uh, Sonsonate City. Oh, thank you so much. And let's see, Jamilet. Jamilet Ramos, where are you from? Okay. 
in love Jamilet. Okay, maybe the next one. How old are you? Do you remember this question? How old are you? How old are you, teacher? I am 33 years I old. Am. <laughs> I am 31. I am 30. Okay. <laughs> you are younger am, than me. I am 28. 50 old. Okay, I am 28. I'm 50 years old. Thank you. Oh. Any other answer? How old are you? Dos respuestas más. Y vamos a la siguiente. How old are you? I am 31. Okay, thank you so much. I am um, 31 years old. And 22 years old. Thank you for your answer. And let's see the next question is, what's your phone number? Do you remember this question? What's your phone number? Seven, seven, five, nine. My Two, phone. Four, eight, eight. Okay, thank you. Remember my that. phone, my phone number is seventy-five and ninety-one. And ¿Cómo se dice treinta? Dice se me olvida siempre. Thirty. And thirty and twenty. Twenty. Okay, so it's seven five nine one three. O two O. Thank you, Olga. What's your phone number? My phone. My number phone is seventy seven seventy. Está bien. O seven zero six nine six nine two zero. Ok, generalmente lo hacemos número por número, ¿verdad? It's okay. num number by number. So you have seven, zero, six, nine, six, nine, two, zero. ¿Y por qué, teacher? Eh, es más fácil, ¿verdad? Generalmente damos nuestro número para algún formulario o porque nos están solicitando esa información para que sea más fácil o más entendible. Lo hacemos number by number para que no haya confusión. Ah, ok. Es cuestión como de comodidad. Para hacerlo un poco más entendible. Thank you so much. So, any other answer? What's your phone number? What's your phone number? What's your phone number, teacher? My phone number. It's seven two four eight five eight six two. So let's continue. Let's go with this. We are going to remember this topic. So uh, objective. Do you remember an objective to describe people's personality? Do you remember some of them? Funny. Okay. Funny is one. With yes. Personality. Yes, personality. Ah, no. <laughs> angry. Funny. Funny. Serious. Angry. Nervous. Serious. Nervous. Intelligent. Smart. Look. Smart. Intelligent. Rude. Selfish. Selfish. Tall. Serious. Talkative, fat, small, quiet, friendly, quiet, friendly, cute. Ah, friendly. Uh, I heard a small. En el caso de small es de apariencia física, pequeño, small. It's physical appearance. Which is short. Handsome. Handsome. It's also a physical appearance. It means Mark. guapo, atractivo. Smart. Pero es para hombre, ¿verdad? Handsome. Yes. Handsome es para hombre, para describir apariencia física. Physical Beautiful appearance. Para mujer. 
beautiful, beautiful is for a woman. Yes, generally used for a woman. Beautiful. Pretty, pretty is another one. Thank you. Old. Old. Yes, old is another one for physical appearance. Let's start with this question. Okay, what's your sister like? What's your sister like? Personality adjective. ¿Quién tiene hermanas? ¿Cómo es ella? What's your sister like? I have a My question. Teacher, is... teacher, I have a question. Tell me, Jorge, what is your question? Eh, eh, ¿Y por qué like? En ese caso, like, eh, ¿qué, ¿qué? ¿Cómo se, se está utilizando ahí el, el like? Eh, like es como, en este caso, como. What's your sister like? ¿Cómo es la personalidad de tu hermano? What's ah. your sister like? Ah, ok. Thank you. Ok. ¿Anyone want to answer this question? What's your sister like? ¿Cómo es su hermana? ¿Cuál es la personalidad? Me dice, she is. My sister is. Ah. Está bien también. My sister is. My sister is. Vamos a decir las eh, características físicas también o solo las personalidades. En este caso, la pregunta, what's your sister like, es para personalidad. La, pre ah. la otra pregunta es, what does your sister like? There is one. Ah, ok. Eh, para like decir, en, para mm -hmm. decir enojada es, es angry, es que la confundo con la otra que es hambre. Hungry. Okay. Es hungry. Hung <laughs> hungry and angry. Angry, es verdad. Yes, angry okay. is the right answer. My sister is very angry. Thank you. And serious. Angry and serious. Thank you so much. My sister is angry and serious. You say very angry. Bueno, deben de cuidarse de no hacerla enojar. She's very angry. <laughs> Any other answer? What's your sister like? My sister my is Kai. In my case, my sister sometimes is friendly and almost angry. Um, okay, thank you for your answer. So then we say, my sister is kind. And the other answer was, my sister is sometimes angry. Algunas veces es enojada. Let's see, what's your my, best? My sister is very intelligent. Thank you so much. My sister is very intelligent. A good sentence, thank you. What's your best friend like? What's your best friend like? Mejor amigo. Yes. ¿Cómo es su mejor amigo o amiga? What's your best friend like? My best friend is very friendly. Okay, thank you so much. My best friend is very friendly. Thank you. Excellent sentence. Any my friend answer? is my friend is Jones. Honest. My honest. friend is honest. Ok, siempre Ay. dice la verdad. ¿Cómo me queda este vestido? Luis? Uy, te queda feo. That is honest. Yes. <laughs> ¿Cómo me veo? Despeinada. That's honest. My He's... God, yes. <laughs> He's honest. Let's go to the next. What's your brother like? Los que tienen hermanos. What's your brother like? My brother is AC. Uh, my brother is crazy or no. lazy? Lazy. <laughs> oh, lazy. He doesn't like to work. He's lazy. He doesn't like to work. Thank you. Any other answer? What's your brother like? You say he's angry, 
he's funny, he's rude, he's polite. My brother is funny. Okay, thank you, Brenda. My brother is funny. Let's see, what's your mother like? My mother is, para decir amorosa, teacher. My Lo mother is lovely. Lovely. My mother is lovely. Uh, my mother is lovely. 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 My mother is lovely. It's lovely. And the last one, what's your father like? My father is serious. Thank you. My father is serious. Porque se en serio los padres. <laughs> Más con las niñas. My father is serious. Any other answer? What's your father like? No more answers. Then let's go with the next. Possessive. Look at this. Is this Sue's scarf? What is a good answer for this question? Is esta la bufanda de Sue? What is a good answer? Is this Sue's scarf? Teacher, I have a question. Tell me, what is your question? Cuando quiero decir, por ejemplo, si mi padre está fallecido, ¿cómo tengo que decir? Oh, then the sentence is this. Excuse me, I'm going to write here for you. And the sentence is this. My father passed away. Pass My away. father passed away. My father is passed away. Ajá, uh -huh. oh, my father I is... Dead. Dead. Passed away. My father passed away. La pronunciación es pass. Mm -hmm. Pass. Past. Past. Con T al final. Past. With D at the end. My father passed away. My father. My father passed away. away. My father is dead. Dead. My dead. father is dead. Okay. You can use these sentences. Okay, thank you for your question. Let's continue with this. Is this Sue's scarf? Yes, it's hers. Oh, thank you. That is a good answer. So you say, yes, it's hers. Yes, it's hers. Let's do the next question. Whose boots are these? Whose boots are these? ¿Cómo comienza la respuesta a esa pregunta? Whose boots are these? Supongamos que son de su hermana. Yes, the, the, these are. Mm. Yes, these are good try, but in this case, it's an information question. Tenemos que decir a quién pertenecen esas botas. Whose boots are these? Si son de su hermana, ¿cómo sería la respuesta? Are my sister. Okay, so they're... They're from they're, my sister. They're, they're my, my sister. sisters. Boot. Boots. They are my sister boots. They are my sister boots. Let's see the next question here. Whose hat is this? Eh, imagínense que es de su father. Whose hat is this? ¿Cuál sería entonces la respuesta? Whose hat is this? And you say it. My father's hat. It's my father's hat. And the last one in this part is this. Are these Peter's and Kathy's coat? Uh, 
Are these Peter and Katy's coats? ¿Cuál sería una buena respuesta? Utilizando poses y pronouns. It's a yes no question. Then you say yes or not. They are. Then you say yes. Yes. There. There's. There's. Yes, there, there's. Okay, do you remember the possessive adjective and the possessive pronouns? The possessive adjective are the next one you say my. What is the other one? Your. His. His her. her they what? It, their, their, our, and our, or their, their. Their. And then we have possessive pronouns, which are the possessive pronouns. Mine. Pronouns, okay, you say mine. Mine. Yours. Yours. Your. Thank you. Yours. His. Yours. His. Oh. Hers. 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 It's ours. 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 And, and theirs. Our, and theirs. theirs. Excellent. Thank you so much. So don't forget about them. Mine, your, his, her, it, ours, and theirs. And the objective, mine, your, his, her, it, our, and theirs. So let's go with the next one. Ya casi estamos terminando with tonight class. Teacher. Let's go with the next exercise. Yes? ¿Cuándo es que vamos a usar los donde es my, you, his, her, it, o? Los possessive adjetivos, los possessive pronouns. Adjetivos. By los adjetivos, siempre antes de un nombre, ¿verdad? Siempre antes de un nombre como my house. Eh, her bike, his car, siempre antes de un nombre van los adjetivos, pronoun. perdón, okay. los poses y adjetivos, los poses y adjetivos, sorry, siempre, siempre antes de un nombre para identificar. ¿Y los pronouns? Los pronouns van después del verbo, let's see, for example, you say, it's mine. Va después del verbo to be. It hers. It hers. Siempre después del verbo. Ok, teacher, thank you. Their hours. Their hours. Así los identificamos. Thank you for your question. Any other question in this part? No more question? Let's go with this exercise then. So, can you please tell me what is he doing? What is he doing? The oh, first one so is riding a bike. What is she doing? She's riding a bike. What is he doing? Riding a bike. He's playing. Riding a bike. A bike. Riding, riding. Riding a bike. He's riding a bike. What is he doing? He's cooking. He's, He's cooking. cooking. What is he doing? He's, He's working. working. He's working. She's working. What is he doing? He's drinking. She's drinking. He's drinking. He's moving. Okay, he's drinking coffee, maybe. And what is she doing? He's watching TV. She okay. watching TV. Is she playing she the trumpet? The guitar. The guitar. She's playing the guitar. The guitar. The guitar. Okay. Oh, is is he playing soccer? Is he playing soccer? No, he is. No, he is. 
Is she running? Is she running? No, no she is. She's are, ready now. Ah, okay. Are they cooking? Not. Yes. Like, no, yes. They are. Yes. Are. Yes, they is are. Are they cooking? So you say, making? yes, they are. Making cookies? Mm, you can use making cookies. They are baking making cookies. cookies. Baking. Making cookies. or baking? Bow. You okay. can use bow. Ambos. Making, haciendo galletas. Baking, horneando. You can use both of them. And okay. what are they doing? What are they doing? They're okay. drinking. They're drinking coffee. Okay, this is the... ¿Cómo se llama este tiempo? Lo que está sucediendo Present. en este momento. Present continuous. Present, Present continuous. O present progressive. Thank you. Okay, let's go with the last. This was reading. a reading that was there. So, what time is it? This is the last exercise for tonight. What time is it? What time is it? It's four it after nine. Oh, the, oh. It's, it's four, seven, four, seven nine. It's three. Forty-five and eight. Two night. <laughs> okay, let's listen. Tell me, Alexandra. Let's tell me, Alexandra, first. Uh, eight. <laughs> it's three to nine. It's three to nine. No, it's fifteen no. to eight. It's fifteen to nine. To eight. It is four. Uh -huh. eight. No, okay, thank you. It's a quarter what to eight. It's a quarter to eight. Thank you. It's a quarter <laughs> to eight. <laughs> ah, okay. Tenía con su en la pantalla, no me había fijado. Ah, okay. It's 12 o'clock. It's 12 o'clock a.m. También podemos decir que it's noon o it's midnight. It's no. It's no. My, it's no. my, my night. night. It, it's midnight. Eight. It's midnight. It's midnight. And oh, what time is it? It's six. to six a.m. Forty. Twenty. Five. Okay. Five. Okay. okay. Escuchemos a Jorge. What time is it, Jorge? It is twenty. To 6 p.m. Okay, thank you so much. In the next Olga, what time is it? It's 9 to 50 p.m. Okay, good try, thank you. Any other option? It's 9 a quarter. Oh, <laughs> casi, casi. You are close. Penetration, <laughs> penetration. No, teacher, no. Vaya, it's a quarter after nine. After two, after nine. It's a quarter after what? nine, or you can say it's 9.15 p.m. It's 9.15 p.m. Or it's a quarter after 9 p.m. What time is it here? It's 11.25 p.m. Thank you so much. It's 11.25 p.m. Or oh, it's 25 after 11 p.m. Yeah. What time is it here? It's no. It's 12. Many, 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 many. I don't know. Okay. It's noon or it's 12 o'clock p.m. Thank you. Also. P.m. P.m. And the last one, what time is it? It's 11. 10 to 11. 11, PM. 11 after, after 10. Mm, no. <laughs> Good try, but no. 11 to 10 PM. 
Mm -hmm. No. You can say it is it's 10 past 11. Okay, thank you. It's 10 past 11 at night. It, oh, usted puede decir, it's 11, 10 p.m. It's 10 after 11 p.m. Okay, so don't forget to practice. Puede practicar, escriba diferentes horas en su cuaderno de apuntes y practique. Let's see. Asking and answering the question, what time is it? De acuerdo, puede hacer ese ejercicio, ¿verdad? Practicar, escriba una hora, y say, what time is it? O de aquí en adelante, cuando vea su reloj, what time is it? Try to say that in English. Intente Richard, decirlo. Solo... Yes? Pero, cuando son las 12 yeah. en punto AM, ¿Cuándo era que vamos a usar mine, mine, no sé si se dice. Midnight, midnight. Midnight, esa. Es acá. Midnight, medianoche. A medianoche, cuando empieza el día, a las 12 a.m. Here is midnight, y si es p.m., here is noon. It's noon, it's midnight. Ah, ok, so that's it. Do you have any question? That's all for tonight, and that's all for the beginner number one. So this is for you. You did it. Congrats. Congratulations to every one of you. Uh, I'm so proud of you. You did a great job during this English course. It was an honor to be your facilitator. My best wishes for the next course. So now in Spanish, lo hicieron. Felicitaciones. Estoy muy orgulloso de cada uno de ustedes. Thank you. You did a great job during this course. Hicieron un gran trabajo durante este curso. Ay, disculpen que los iba apurando con la plataforma, ¿verdad? Pero teníamos que terminar eso. So, Al mismo was, tiempo. Yes, yes, we did. So, it was an honor to be your facilitator. Ha sido un honor haber sido su facilitador y conocerlas. Ustedes ha sido grandioso. So, my best wishes for the next course. Mis mejores deseos para el siguiente curso, ¿verdad? Y espero que sigan aprendiendo ¿verdad? sobre este idioma que es muy interesante y muy bonito. Y espero que sigan, ¿verdad? En los siguientes niveles. Sigámonos esforzando para seguir aprendiendo muchísimo más. ¿De acuerdo? Oh, thank you, Brenda. Yes, teacher. Gracias. My thank pleasure. You. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Ha sido muy bueno para mí que usted haya sido nuestro profesor. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, Julia. ¿Alguien tiene algún comentario, alguna queja? This is the comment. Ninguna Solo daré la gracia. Perfecto, Pero Muchísimas gracias. Ok. Bueno, espero que hayamos aprendido, ¿verdad? Es el comienzo. Un largo camino, pero ya dimos el primer paso. Y es lo importante, es empezar es lo que cuesta ahora ya están en el camino sigan inscribiendo en los, los siguientes cursos para que vayan avanzando y vayan aprendiendo muchísimo más bueno les deseo éxito en ¿Te todo pueden guardar su número teacher para cualquier cosa yes you can do that no problem ahí en el grupo okay. lo pueden encontrar de acuerdo si okay. necesitan algo Gracias. va a ser un gusto poder ayudarles ha sido un gusto haberlos conocido. Felices vacaciones desde ya. Que disfruten mucho. Cuídense. Y espero verlos por ahí en algún otro curso. So, bye, bye. Thank you, teacher. Bye, teacher. Bye, bye. 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 bye, bye.